Hi guys, I'm back with more questions. It's Madam Morio, and I'm answering the last few um, Nintendo video game themed questions. And then I'm going to be answering Peach questions. So, um, here we go. Uh, EB Spirit asks, Who's your favorite villain in any game you have played and why? Um, well, I mean, really, my favorite is Bowser because he's, like, hilarious. Um, like, I love him in Mario Party, and just, I love how he looks in the older games, because he looks so cute, but he's so funny. Um, but if you want to be, like, you know, more creative than that. Uh, I love the, I love the Koopa Bros from, uh, Paper Mario, and, like, because they're just so cool, they're awesome. And then, hmm. I like, well, I don't know. I mean, I keep just thinking of them and, like, Bowser, so I guess I'd say those two mainly. Um, because I really, I haven't played a game against Wario, really. I've only played with Wario, not at Wario. So, uh, I'm going to go with those two. Pikmin1129 asks, How did you get all of your games? I bought them or received them as gifts. Banzit Coot, Banzai Coot, I don't know, asks, have you ever played Bomberman 64, and if so, do you, or did you like it? I've never played it before, I've only seen like a bunch of reviews and stuff of it on, um, or in Nintendo Power and stuff like, in online. Like, I've never played it though, no. Um, but I, I'm not really, that's not really like the type of game I always go for, like the puzzle kind. But, um, so no, I haven't played that. Sorry, I can't be more awesome with, it, with that answer. Uh, Drunk Goomba1645 asks, Do you and Slim win to get together and co-commentate slash play against each other on a Mario Party board? Well, I'm pretty sure we both would like to do that, but, um, with the lack of Wi-Fi in any of the games and... Um, a few other reasons, it's, you know, maybe eventually, but not, we would both like to, I guess, but, like, we, I don't really know, there's no straight answer for that, really. Um, but that wraps up the Nintendo and video game category. Um, so now it's time to move on to the Peach questions. Uh, Mario Star plus Luigi asks, what would you use to kill Peach? Um, uh, somebody else? I'd say I'd probably have somebody else do it for me because I wouldn't want to. I wouldn't want to be the killer. I'd pay somebody. I don't know. Um, <laughs> better I'd use Boo. Boo will get the job done. Super Poke Dude 123 asks, How would you kill Peach? Knife? Push off the of building? Gun or all of the above? I'd probably push off a building if I had to pick one, but again, I would just say a person to do it for me. Um, so either that or none of the above, technically. Uh, Flying Chink asks, If you woke up as Princess Peach one day, what would you do? I would run far, far away from whoever woke up as me. Uh, Zach the Ninja 300 asks if Princess Peach and Princess Daisy got into a fist fight, who do you think would win? Uh, probably Daisy, because Peach sucks. Uh, um, yeah. Uh, Super Funny 2343 asks if you met Princess Peach, what would you do to her slash with her? Um, I would punch her first. I would punch her and then I would tell her she's an idiot. I don't like her. Um, let's see, Bowser4013587 That's a lot of numbers, sorry. Uh, asks, why do you hate Princess Peach? Oh, I've shared this story multiple times. Um, it all started back in Mario Kart when she started being rude to me and screwing my game up and being the reason I got second in crap and just always was against Toad when I played Toad and just like, oh, she's so annoying. She's in another castle. She's never in the right place at the right time. 
and she just gets captured all the time. And in a Mario Party, she does nothing but steal from me and be rude to me. So that's why. And if you don't, if you want proof, watch my Mario Party videos. Um, Eddie Pikachu asks if you were able to lock up Peach and dress up exactly like her without anyone noticing. What would you do to humiliate her? Example, her reputation, everyone calling her a whore, etc. <laughs> oh, well, let's see, if I dressed up like Peach, hmm, what would I do? I'd probably, I don't even know. If I, hmm. I probably just sit there punching myself in the face for being such an idiot. But then I wouldn't actually hurt myself, so that would be tough. I don't know. That's a really tough question. Um, but yeah, I'd probably just do something really... Because the, the bad thing is if I dressed up like her, it'd be technically me. So, I don't know. I'd probably just do something really annoying, though, that everybody would hate her for. Uh, then they'd understand how I feel if they don't already. Um, so yeah, sorry, that's kind of a weird answer, but oh well. Clone Ohai asks, if Princess Peach showed up at your house and wanted to fight you with her fist, which weapon would you use to fight back? Um, hmm, like if I had to use a weapon? Probably my fist, the buff arms. I would falcon punch. Um, so probably just my... That or I'd throw my N64 controller at her face and be like, you suck. Um, Kiyo Kenshin asks, What is it about P Princess Peach that we all hate so much? Everything? Pretty much. Um, but those are all the Peach questions, so now I'm going to move on to, um, the random questions, um, because those, that concludes the beach questions. Alright, so these are random. Dillyboy21 asks, what celebrity do you think you look like? I don't know. I don't really think I look like anyone, actually. Um, when I was little, I used to look like Hermione or Emma Watson. I used to look kind of like that, but not, I don't look like her anymore, because she looks different than me, and I look different from her, so... I don't know. I don't really see myself looking as like anyone. That's like something I've asked other people. Who do I look like? And no one really knows either. Um, so I don't know. No, no one really. Master of Anything asks, if you could travel to any part of the world, where would you go? Um, I would love to go to Japan someday. Tokyo, Japan. See that because so many things I love come from there. It seems like a really neat place, so I would love to go there. Um, and also Myrtle Beach, because it's my favorite place in the world. Uh, okay, the K-Man 538 asks, Are you able to do a worm? No. I've tried so many times, and I just, like, flop like a fish and look horrible. So no, I'm not able to do the worm at all. Um, let's see, where am I? Okay. PSID412 asks, what's your favorite Michael Jackson song, and do you have a favorite routine by him? My favorite Michael Jackson song is Heal the World. I know it's like not a dancey one or anything, but I love the message in it, and I love the like melody of the song. I have a lot of memories with that song. So Heal the World is my favorite. I have a lot of really, really, really close seconds. Um, and then my favorite routine... The thriller is kind of a given. Like, I love that dance, but so does the rest of the world, kind of. Uh, so other than, like, thriller, um, I have to say Remember the Time. I love the dance from Remember the Time. Um, and the dance from Speed Demon is really good, too. Let's see. Uh, okay. All right. Uh, Power to Mario asks, the quintessence. Now, why would you throw this word at me? You are so mean. Okay. Uh, Madame Wario has always been to work hard. To work hard, I'm sorry. Stay in school, remain as classy as possible, and be an all around pimp. How do you work so hard? How do you stay in character so well? And 
Will any of us have a Merry Christmas slash Christmas without a quirky dance? Well, considering Christmas is already over, uh, if you needed that, I'm sorry. I failed. Uh, so I guess, yes, I hope you did. Um, oh, how do I work so hard? I don't know. I'm so random. I just, like, punch through it. I don't know. I like to... Once I'm committed to something, it's like it has to happen. Um, like with anything, any kind of project I start or something I do. So uh, that's just kind of how I am. How do you stay in character so well? I don't know. I've never... I've honestly never been anyone but myself. You can ask like anyone I know and they're like, you never change. And I'm like, I know. I've never changed, ever. I've been the same person forever, so I've never gone through these like weird phases like people do. But anyway, um, that should answer your question, PTM. Oh, and by the way, it's a mirage. Luigi Rules 581 asked, if you're from Africa, why are you white? I, you can't just ask people why they're white. Idiot. No, I'm just kidding. You know I love you. Anyway, if you had one million dollars, what would you buy with the money? Oh, gosh. I don't know. Um, well, I'd want to be like, I'd want to donate some of it to like, I would have to think about which cause, but like animal rights, because I love animal rights, but what would I buy with it? Um, I would buy, um, I would buy a car, number one, because that's something I need. Uh, number two, I'd buy, um, hmm, I would definitely try to get together my own, like, theater, like, uh, build my own dance theater for, like, what I want to do later. Um, so that's what I would buy. Um, all right, Magic TDS, or S5, I'm sorry, asks, if you could have any superpower in the world, what would it be? Um, flying, definitely. Oh my gosh. I would want to fly so bad. I, I'm not afraid of heights at all or anything. I would love flying, but, you know. You know how that goes. Barkley KB asks, what are you studying in school? Okay, this is going to be like a really weird, kind of long answer. Um, what I'm studying in school is called experiential management. It's uh, basically business management for a really specific business of which you are trying to plan. Um, which is what I'm trying to do with dance. So that's why that's my major, not just dance for being a dancer. I'm trying to be like a choreographer, like that end of it. Um, so that's what I'm studying, um, management for that, basically. So it's like that kind of management. Um, Zach Ruo Rath, I don't know if that's how you say that, asked, do you know of Dark Minded Sith? Yes, I love Dark Minded Sith. He's Sith Minded. Um, yes, I know of him. I know him pretty well. Um, alright, let's see. Am I out of time? Okay, I have time for one more question. 12 Brady 2 Moss 81 asked, Do you watch sports? If so, what's your favorite team? No, I don't watch sports. I am not a sports person at all. Especially not football. And I live in Indiana and it's like Colts everywhere. And I'm like, no, I don't I don't care. Uh no, I'm not a sports person at all. So, um I don't. Sorry, I don't have a favorite team either. Um so that pretty much just answers that. Uh, but I will be back next time with more questions, and we're getting down to the last, um, you know, well, not few, but we're getting, we've covered a lot of them, so I'll see you next time.